What is going on guys, it's Waffle here, and welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. I got a comment last episode saying that I should like click on the E here on the, on the title screen. Oh! <laughs> An ancient alien! What? Hold on, was it? Oh, I guess it's only that one right there. <laughs> okay, so I've, I guess if you spam click on the E on, on Stardew on the title screen over here, you're getting ancient alien doing two peace signs and then he just kind of disappears. <laughs> I guess that makes sense because remember last episode we actually learned that the, uh, the, the, the dwarves might actually be ancient aliens themselves. So anyways, let's jump into the actual game here. Now remember last time we left off in Stardew Valley, we killed a bunch more bugs in the mine, uh, donated about 80 bug meat over to, uh, as I'm holding an eggplant up in my head randomly. <laughs> We also donate about 80 bug meat to Willy as well, so that's going to be a great progress right there. I don't know if we're actually be able to finish. Oh, I don't have enough coal here. I don't know if we're actually be able to finish the uh, the, the bug meat mission over here. You guys remember we have this juicy bugs wanted. Hey there, looking for a blah blah blah. We have 34 out of the hundred bug meat that we need to collect. I think we got this mission on either Tuesday or something like that. I don't think it was Monday, uh, but you know the six or so days from there, and we only have. 34, so a little bit over third the way there, and then of course we're uh, 80 out of 100 on this one right here. Uh, but we were able to donate some of the bug meat we already had, so that's why that one's up a little bit more. But I guess this episode, what I want to do is head straight back to the mines once again, just like we did last episode, and try and get as much bug meat as possible. Especially because I did get a comment suggesting a really cool strategy we could try out to try and get bug meat a little bit more efficiently. So let's definitely try that out. We also get the thing in the mail right here. It looks like hello, friend from Linus. The mountain lake has been kind to me lately. I'd like to share a good. Oh yeah, we. Last, at the end of last episode, he gave us a uh, a largemouth bass or something like that, but now he gave me a Maki roll. Okay, that could be pretty good for our uh, mining adventures. I don't know, maybe I'll just go put that up in storage or something like that for right now, but that crab, I do want to go put that up. Now remember last episode, in the mines, we actually found an ancient seed, and a lot of you guys commented saying, yeah, don't plant that. Uh, you definitely want to, and also, you guys were saying if I donate it to Gunther, where did I put it? I think I put it over here, didn't I? Yeah, there it is right there. It does say it's an artifact. It does say Gunther. You can tell me more about it if you donate to the museum. You guys said if I donate to him, he'll give me an actual seed I could use to plant. And I think that's the one you guys are saying. Don't plant that one just yet. Because apparently it takes like 28 days or something like that. And we're far too uh, too far into the month right now to be able to plant anything. That takes a whole entire uh, month to grow, right? So, yeah, I guess we'll have to wait until spring to actually plant that. So that kind of sucks. But uh, let's go put up the Maki roll. There we go. We have a little bit of stone in our inventory. I guess I'll put that up as well. I did get some comments of you guys saying, yeah, if you go... If if you go somewhere like to the mines or whatever, you don't you definitely don't want to take stuff that you're not going to be using, like the copper axe, the fiberglass fishing rod, the scythe. That'll save us a little bit of uh, inventory space as well as so, uh, be able to donate that, right? Uh, or what am I saying? Not donate, but uh, be able to pick up more loot. What I did want to donate, though, I was getting ahead of myself here, is this five gold star corn. I do want to go donate that to the museum before I heck and forget, but we'll probably do that in the second half of the episode. But for right now, we have a random eggplant in our inventory. Did we donate that yet, by the way? Because I remember saying something about the eggplant. I guess we did. Okay. Okay, so that's good. Uh, so, uh, oh yeah, because it's a new day, I'm going to water all the heckin' crops again. But I guess we can go check them on the chickens. I did actually, uh, at the end of last episode, I said something about one. Oh yeah, then we have to pet them to. There you go. Oh yeah, what is the. Uh, oh, we're at a half a heart right there. Not bad. Mirrors looks really happy today. Okay, that's good. Where's the other one at? We had a white. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Let's go pet this one as well. And Zacha looks very happy today as well. That's great. So we have a half heart on them. So we're slowly getting some progress there. Do we have anything in the taps yet? No, I guess not. I forget when we put that up, but apparently it takes like a whole week before. Oh, there are the eggs. It takes like a whole entire week before you actually get anything out of that. So that kind of sucks. I did actually propose, propose the idea of potentially buying more chickens to you guys at the end of last episode. And uh, a lot of you guys actually did say, yeah, you definitely do want to get more chickens, uh, especially because I'm pretty early in the game still. So, you know, getting more chickens means getting more uh, mayonnaise machines, therefore getting more mayonnaise and therefore more money. So that's always good. I definitely want to get that done. And uh, speaking of Marnie, who we buy the uh, chickens from, I do want to continue giving her some stuff so we can get on her good side as well as... Uh, oh yeah, by the way, to get on her good side as well to uh, to get the heckin' purple pants out of her room. And after we do that, we can actually use those purple pants as like sort of a meme to try and use during the, uh, the festival next week, right? Uh, also, speaking of... Like last episode and stuff like that. Apparently Jody's birthday was like yesterday in game. So that kind of sucks that we forgot about that, right? But uh, real quick, you guys know the deal. The new thing that I'm doing here where I water all the crops where I can uh, focus on it and not be talking and miss heckin' slots and stuff like that over here. So <laughs> let me just water all the crops over here. I'll grab those eggplants. I'll cook, put them up, all that kind of stuff. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit uh, whenever we actually go to the mines to try and get more bug meat and try out that new strategy I brought up. So I'll see you guys here in... Whoops. I'll see you guys here in just a bit. 
I guess back, just got done watering everything and emptied out my inventory and everything. Ate a few blackberries because I was almost out of energy. Also went inside and I saw this coffee right here. You guys remember this? Has a plus one speed right there. So I feel like, oh, and there's a uh, thing right there. Nice. So I feel like if we take this coffee right now, we'll actually be able to move a little bit faster and hopefully find bug meat just a little bit fa Oh yeah, I could definitely see that. Now how long does that last? Does that last all day or something? I feel like it might. Oh no, it only lasts for like a minute or something like that. Man, I, I was kind of on the impression it might have lasted all day, or at least, you know, for the rest of the day, but... Man, I guess I'm gonna be, uh... Oh, jeez. I'm gonna heckin' crash here from all this, this, like, coffee high, I guess you could describe it as, but... Uh, one strategy, uh, was... I think I said I wanted to start at level 15. And then, uh, we come down here, find any bugs, kill any bugs... And then we just, like, go up the heckin' elevator to the next level, and apparently that's, like, a really good strategy to try and... Try and use, and I'm... Probably gonna miss out on that, like, purple rock or whatever that that guy mentioned uh, a few episodes ago. No, no things over there just looking for bugs don't even oh wait here you go here you go perfect i love when i see maggots oh there you go. that means bug time okay two two bug meat right there not bad but also not good uh, i could try and find the way down but i feel like these early levels right here don't really give us too many bugs so skip it to level 20 that might be a little well 21 that is that might be a little bit better yeah there's a little bit of iron right there those are just slimes not going to worry about them just going to forget about them and i think that's it for this layer actually i don't think we really need copper that bad so, uh, leave the mine. I think leave the mine. I think that's what they mean. Now, if I leave the mine, does that reset it? Like, I can go back to 15? Oh, yeah, look at that. We have a new bug right there. Okay, so if we just straight up... Only oh, wow, look at all these bugs. Awesome. We have a diglet down there as well trying to attack us. That seems like a pretty good strategy. So we could actually skip to level 25, I bet. I think it's just slimes down there. Oh, wait. Oh, we got the flying, uh, thing. <laughs> the flying version of the maggot. There you go. Another bug meat right there. Awesome. Okay, so I think I said... Whatever I looked it up was 15 to 25 were the layers. So I think, I think if we go to 15 to, tw well, 21, and then go to 25, oh, is that a flying bug? Right? I think that's a flying bug. Oh, yes, it is. Okay, those guys are basically guaranteed uh, bug meat, I think, right? Oh, I just actually have to kind of dig to him, though. There we go. Oh, well, we found the way right down right there, so I guess that's cool. And if, oh, yes, maggots right there. Perfect. I know I already joked about, oh, man, I'm so excited to find maggots. All of a sudden, there's already a way down right there, too. Ooh, okay. I don't know, why is that even there? I didn't break anything. Nothing happened. I'm like, I'm not complaining, but... Okay, I guess I guess I can go down. It's not like it really matters, right? As long as uh, I have a higher higher likelihood of finding bugs and therefore bug meat, then hey, I'm not going to complain. Boom, there you go. We're up to eight right there, so what do we have? 34 in total already. There's another bug over here. Yeah, these guys aren't guaranteed bug meat, but uh, yeah, so that one didn't drop one. The one like two two times ago didn't drop one either. I don't know if we could actually find bug meat in those barrels and stuff, though. That'd be Oh, wow, a few maggots over here. Nice. And a rock crab, so we're probably going to get, get a crab. We could sell and get a little bit of money out of that. We got a rice shoot seed right there, too. Nice. I mean, that's, yep, that's the rock crab. Man, I really wish I had a better uh, weapon. I don't know why it doesn't give me a better way. It's been a long time since we got a better weapon, you guys. It sucks. But I guess we'll leave now. Leave the mine. There you go. And, uh, oh, yeah, because we don't have access to the thing. Yeah. I guess we'll go to 15 again. There you go. Oh, nice maggots. Yeah, this this strategy works out pretty well. So it does seem like every time you like leave the mine, as it says, then that that basically resets the mine. There we go. And yeah, there's nothing else there. Okay, so I guess we'll just leave again. I kind of want to skip to like layer 25 or something next. I wonder if we're going to find a bunch of bugs over there. It's 3 p.m. right now. And we already have how many? How many do we have? We have 11. That's really good considering we got what 18 or 19 last time, and we spent like literally all day in there. Or you know. Almost all day. Man, I got slow by the slime. Ah, oh, man, yeah, my coffee, like, high is gone now, too, so that sucks. Ah, oh, man. Actually, it's kind of surprised you don't get a caffeine crash. It'd be pretty funny. Yeah, let's just go to level 20 here, or 21. Golly. Yeah, no bugs there, so uh, hopefully I find bugs here. Get rid of some of the weeds, or tall grass, or whatever this is. There you go. Nothing there, nothing, nothing anywhere. Just a diglet guy right there. That's it, man. I find the way down immediately. Wow, Geode got iron there, man. That's good. At least we're able to break things pretty fast over here. Oh, wow. Okay, there's the way down. I'm, try I'm trying to heckin' speed run like crazy over here, you guys. It's awesome. There you go. Get rid of that. Kill this maggot guy. I'll have to kill one more. There you go. And then kill him. There we go. Now we got the bug meat right there. I think I see... No, that's a slime. Man. I that was another bunch of maggots down there, but I guess not. Now, where's that one? Yeah, there's a ladder right here. That one... Oh, flying bug. Yeah, if I can get it swarmed again, I don't know what layer that was. Nice. Another bug meat. Nice. Okay, so we're up to 13 with, uh, it's 5 p.m. right now. Awesome. I think there was a bunch of bugs up here. Well, there were previously, but I don't know why there aren't any right now. Man. All right, well, either find the way down or go right back to the elevator and reset it, right? I don't know. I don't want to spend too much time, but I'm like, there's so many rocks right next to each other that uh, we might have a higher likelihood of actually finding the way down. 
Nah, it doesn't seem like that's working. Man, you know that or try and break that big one right there. I don't know. There's three of them like right here. So, uh, none really. I'm, I'm, I'm going on the way back to, there we go, to the elevator. There we go. Oh, this is, yeah, this is that big room. So, oh, oh, maggots right there. Okay, perfect. And a flying bug. Awesome. Did we, I don't think we got a bug meat from though, but there you go. No bug meats from any of those maggots? What? Come on. That doesn't make any sense. We got like three of them right there. Nothing happened. Yeah, leave the mine again. Okay. Yeah, th this seems to be working pretty well right here. Resetting, leave the mine, all that kind of stuff. And then coming back and then, well, there's nothing there. No, not even a diglet, it seems. What? No maggots up there? As you guys can see, every time we come here, it's like the exact same like shape. It's just that, like all the rocks, all the all the critters, all the terrain, or you know, like like the weeds and stuff of like that. All that stuff gets reset, which is interesting. Let's keep going down, keep resetting, basically. Oh wow! And I love when there are barrels and stuff too. Boom! Broke that. Kind of sound like I said broom right there. <laughs> but uh, let's keep going around, and see if we can find any more flying critters. Nope, just. <sighs> all right. Well, at least we have the. Uh... Oh, that's not the elevator. Yeah. Because we had to go down the stairs right there. Oh, we got, well, at least we got slime right there. So that's not too bad, I suppose. But uh, leave the mine again. <laughs> Guess we'll leave the mine and go back to layer 15 and all that kind of stuff. Seems like these are the layers to find bugs. At least that's what I read. I don't know. I might, I might try and go to like layer 3. Oh, wow. Maggot right there. There we go. Finally got another bug meat right there. 710 at 14 bug meat. That's decent. Remember, we didn't go to the to the mines yesterday in game. We like spent all day like doing anything. Oh, Oh, nice, a maggot right there, nice. <laughs> we spent like all day doing other stuff, I believe, right? So, yeah, at least we could, if, if we can make up for not getting any bug meat yesterday, that'd be really good. But uh, I guess we'll go down here, nothing. Oh, flying bug. Ah, if I can kill him and get a bug meat, that'd be really good. And we'll just, oh wow, bug meat and a way down? Don't mind if I do. Now, are there any bugs here? I'm not seeing any, man. Oh, there's, well, there's amethyst right there. I don't know. I, I guess I could break it real quick just because it is worth something. Maybe we'll get a little bit of money out of it. Maybe we'll give it to Abigail. Get a really good relationship. We haven't given her anything in a while, so. Might have to. Oh, perfect. Getting swarmed. Now, if I could have a level where it's like at the skull on the top left corner, where it says, oh, you can't. Oh, nice maggots. <laughs> where it says, oh, you can't leave unless you kill all the, all enemies in here. That'd be really, really good, you guys. And yeah, we did do a little bit of damage with the pickaxe, but using the bug head, which is so weird. <laughs> using the bug head to kill bu actual bugs. But, uh,. I don't know what I was saying right there. <laughs> I like how I always forget things whenever I get distracted. Like, two layers of distraction. I just forget what I was talking about beforehand. <laughs> Anyways, let's keep going. I guess we go to the ladder, and I guess uh, leave the mine. I, I kind of want to go to, like, layer 30 or something like that. See what's over there. See if anything new is over there. So I can see if we can find any bugs or what. Just because I am curious. Oh, it's this Yeah, see this layer? Yeah. I don't think we get any bugs there. That's just, like, the rock golems and stuff like that, right? What if we go to layer 40? What was this again? Oh yeah, this is the ice. Were there bugs here? No, there's just ice slimes and... Yeah, well, there's iron there. I do need that. I might as well grab it while I'm here. There we go. Just so we could use that for some stuff. There we go. We also need gold, but uh, there we go. And I guess I'll do this on the way out. It's uh, 9 p.m. right now. Yeah, man. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I guess, if anything, this is a little bit of a grinding sort of deal right here. Usually, I would do this stuff off camera. But, uh, I don't know, maybe maybe next time I'll do it off camera. Oh man, we found the way down right there, nice. Uh, but you know, at least for this time, I kind of wanted to show it, just kind of showcase the strategy that uh, someone competent saying I should try out. We're currently at 20 bug meat at 10 p.m. That's not bad, a couple of uh, maggots down here, great. Might actually take that staircase down instead of resetting. Awesome, rice shoot, and a bug meat right there. So we're at 21. We found that level, or uh, that number again, nice. Oh, there's actually two ways down right there, I didn't notice that. And maggots, awesome. And boom, boom, slaughter. Nice, another bug meat right there, awesome. So I don't know when I want to. I don't know when I'd be comfortable leaving the mine right now. We're at uh, 22 right now, which is okay. Maybe maybe once we get to 25 and or midnight or like midnight 30 or whatever, maybe that'd be pretty good. Any bugs over here? Nothing, but there is a barrel, so I guess I'll break it just for curiosity's sake. And we found a topaz, not bad. I don't know how much money we got all that stuff. I'm pretty sure I already donated a topaz to the museum because that sounds super familiar now. So uh, there you go. Where, where do we go? I don't know what level that was. <laughs> I don't know. Layer 20. There you go. Layer 421. And then yep. any bugs here? Oh, nice. A few maggots over there. Oh, wow. A lot of them. Not bad. There's a slime right there, too. Kill these guys. At least I'm... Oh, and we found the way down, too. Awesome. As long as... Uh, oh, wow. We're up to 27. As long as we uh, kill them before they transform into the flying version of them, that's good. Although, I don't know if the flying version would have a higher likelihood of actually dropping bug meat, you know? It's 1120. I'm trying to keep my eye on the top corner where the time is so I don't leave 
too late and end up passing out like right at my front door. <laughs> like I did last time, right? Or like two times ago or whatever that was. But uh, yeah. I, I guess next episode, whenever I go back to the mines again, I'll definitely have to do this off camera and hopefully I have better luck. But this time around 27 from one run, possibly almost 30. That's actually not bad. I don't know if I could find that. Oh yeah, it's getting late right now. I might try one more run at layer 15 and then I guess that'll be it. It's 12 right now. Let's leave the mine. Because it seemed like, at least for layer 15, we don't have to go through another uh, ladder, like, immediately, like, level 20, uh, you have to do that. Just slimes and maggots and a couple flies, are they're awesome. We're probably going to get a lot of bug meat here, hopefully. Got two right there, not bad. There's even a, oh man, another maggot right there and another flying guy, awesome. Okay, hurry, 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 hurry. Kill, kill, kill. Awesome, I'll get another bug meat. And there you go, okay, another bug meat. Take the stairs, take the ladder down, and then use this ladder to leave. Okay, 1230 right now, awesome timing, but we got slowed by the slime. Okay, whatever. Okay, 1240 right now. We already learned earlier in the series that it takes about one hour to go from like one end of the map to the other, right? So we should be able to make it back home. And I, I, I keep saying this, but I feel like this top pathway over here is a little bit faster. I don't know why. They're probably equidistant, either whichever pathway I go. But I feel like this way, maybe just because there's not so many obstacles, I don't, I don't have to go through town or anything like that. I just feel like this is a little bit faster to go from the mines to my house. I don't know if you guys know if it's like, True or not, but uh, wow, we have 33. Holy heck, that's a good number. Oh, what in the world? What am I going to? Oh, I guess if I, yeah, I can grab that. <laughs> I don't know why I like instinct instinctually went to. Oh, wow, we got the uh, cranberry jelly. Uh, I don't know why I went there to get the uh, the mayonnaise right there, <laughs> like instinctually, like I was saying right there. But uh, yeah, okay, let's leave. I'll, I'll take care of the other stuff in the morning. Let's go to bed. 1 30. Come on, pet my dog before bed. Hey, there you go. He, he knew I pet him and he showed me some love while uh. He was asleep. That's so cool. I did get comments of you guys saying not to bother the chickens like past like 9 p.m. or something like that, right? Which I, I guess I kind of did right there. So that kind of sucks. Maybe that kind of ruined their happiness there. So I don't know. Either way, we got uh, four mayonnaise right there. Yeah, you can see the mayonnaise doesn't take anywhere near as long as like jelly does. But speaking of such, get 200 out of that. And yeah, today definitely want to give pay Marnie a visit. Give her a gift. Try and get on her good side. Get just two hearts. Uh, and then we should be able to uh, go into her bedroom, get the purple pants. And then while we're there, buy some chickens, right? 100 from that one crab. And then uh, let's see what day 13 has to give us. What's this? What day was yesterday? Thursday? So today's Friday? Friday the 13th? Oh, no, it's Saturday. Okay. Man, that would have been so spooky. I, don't, I guess there can't be a Friday the 13th, right? At least how the calendar is set up. <laughs> That'd be, I, I wonder if they set up specifically just to avoid Friday the 13th on the calendar. That'd be pretty funny. Uh, but we do have some coal and some uh, some of that, so I guess we can take care of that. I don't know why I didn't put the fiber up. There you go. It sounds like it's rainy out? Or is it just windy out? I don't know. What is it? Uh, clouded with gusts of winds throughout the day. Okay. Well, that's tomorrow, but fortune says... Displeased today. Okay. Well, I guess we'll go outside and... Yep, it is windy. Okay, so I'm going to, I'm going to water all the crops again. You guys know the deal. Oh, man, I probably should have... We did have a little bit of time. I could have... Uh... Oh, and by the way, someone said something about the red mushroom. Ah, oh, it's not it's not bouncing on the community center. I guess I already gave them uh, the, the blue mushroom for both those things. Were they talking about a different one? Purple mushroom already gave that. Moral, didn't I? Oh, wait, does it only do that when it's in your inventory? No, no, no. I feel like it didn't give a purple mushroom for some reason. I don't know why. Spice berry, then winter root. Now, we, I think we've only used berries on the, the jelly making thing over there. I guess we could make, like, pickled something. So how would we do that? We need to get... Something over here. Hot pepper jelly. I'm like, I was trying to get that with that, but unfortunately, I'm unable to do that. I guess eggplant? Can we do that? Bok choy, maybe? Oh, yeah, I forgot to plant. Yeah. Remember, someone said to get a, a bunch of bok choy and just plant that and get a bunch of farming XP, right? So there you go. Let's get that going. And uh, let's get the, there you go. Get the copper going as well. And we have a geode again. Oh, and we have iron too. Cool. Uh, let's plant more of these mixed seeds over here. It looks like, yeah, we did plant mixed seeds here not too long. Uh, oh, now, now I need to get the hoe and all that stuff back. But uh, yeah, remember we did plant mixed seeds there not too long ago, so that's cool. Uh, we do have rice shoots here too. There you go. Stack those up with the rice shoots we already have. Some stone, coal, hazelnut. I guess we'll have to put the hazelnut over, over here. There you go. Amethyst and whatever else. Yeah, let's get the iron going because I know that takes a lot longer. Oh, I need. Oh, I don't have any coal. I knew that. I don't think we have any coal over here, right? I guess we could check. Just because. Uh, oh, yeah. Did, yeah. Didn't we get some from the mine or uh, from the museum or something? I think so. And then we have more iron right there, so I guess we'll grab that. There you go, five, and then put that, put that, put that, and then stone, and I think, and I guess we can keep that copper. And uh, geode, I guess I can keep that in my inventory, just because I know I want to go to the museum, or uh, to the blacksmith later anyways, right? So there you go. And I guess that's it. I guess I'll just get my tools out, start taking care of the farm over here. Let's get the, uh, oh, we already have the hoe. What am I talking about? 
uh, copper axe. I don't know. I'll, I'll grab these all over again. <laughs> I do need to plant a couple more plots over here. It looks like we have more raspberries or whatever those are. Cranberries. So that's cool. Let's plant. There you go. Boom. Then these two right here. Okay. Uh, but but because someone did say, oh, and I don't have fertilizer. Whatever. Not that, not, not, not that big of a deal. There you go. And actually, I don't know. Is it too late to put fertilizer here? Did I not grab the water? I thought I grabbed the watering can right there. <laughs> I guess not. There, grab all these right there. Is anything else done? Yeah, it looks like a couple corn over here is done. That's good. So like some of the iron is done too. That's cool. Usually it takes a lot longer than that. Oh no, it just made that flame ripple sound or whatever that was. Uh, let's get another one going. There we go. Perfect. Oh, I, didn't, I don't know why I didn't get the iron going there. Whoops. What was I doing? I was doing something right there. I forgot what I was doing. <laughs> oh yeah, I was going to get the, uh, the watering can. I forgot about that. Golly. Uh, so there you go. Grab that. Yeah, I don't know if it's too late to use the fertilizer. If we already planted it, I guess we could try it. That'd be kind of weird if he could use it still, but... Uh... Oh, you can. Okay, so that's cool. So there you go. All right, well, uh, let me get these all watered. You guys know the deal. I guess I'll see you guys here in just a bit. We'll uh, go pay Marnie a visit, buy a couple more chickens from her, and then we'll have our chicken coop basically full. If we want to have more chickens, we're going to have to actually upgrade it from uh, Robin, right? And I think that's like multiple thousands of dollars. I don't think it's like 10,000 or anything like that. Probably like 4,000 or something like that, if I had to guess. Not too crazy, right? But it is, uh, I'm like, we can't afford that right now. We have 5,800. That's a lot. I didn't think we had that much money. And we have even more money tied up in all those like gold star items, right? And speaking of such, gold star corn. Definitely want to go donate that to the uh, to the community center. Don't want to forget about that, right? But uh, like I said, <laughs> before I forget that I wanted to pause. <laughs> Let me pause. Keep watering over here. Make sure I don't get too distracted and miss something. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Alright guys, I'm back, and we're at 67 bugs out of 100 right now for collecting all the bug meat. I kind of want to go back there and try that again, maybe get up to like 75 or 80 or something like that, just a little bit, not a whole day down there or anything like that, because I don't want to spend too much time, but then again, it's right at the end of the week and it resets on Monday and it's Saturday right now, right? So, kind of want to get that done, I was like, you know what, while I was going through all of our gold star stuff to get the corn, I was like, you know what, maybe a gold star wheat is going to be good for Marnie, so I'm going to try that out, see if she likes that, see if the, that'll be like a really loved gift or whatever from her. And then uh, that'd be pretty cool, right? Uh, then I guess we have to empty our inventory just a little bit more, right? Uh, scythe, I guess we don't need that. Uh, fiberglass rod, I'm probably not going to go fishing, so I guess we'll put those two up, right? So that should be pretty cool. And then uh, Geode, I guess if we try to open that up, and then uh, while we're in the area, I guess we'll donate 20 of that bug meat to Willy, kind of get that part of the mission done. I'll have to also consume a few things over here, too. So uh, Blackberry, there we go. Oh yeah, I didn't really, oh yeah, look at that, there's a hazelnut right there. I guess I can go uh, grab that on our way back. But, uh, yeah, I didn't really look around town. Remember last episode, we cleaned out a decent amount of the, uh, oh man, there's some right there I could have scythed up. Oh man, everyone's saying hi and hello, there's Jazz and Penny and all them. Yeah, you know what, let's just casually, how do I just casually talk to someone? Hey, Penny, how you doing? Oh wait, that's Jazz. Sometimes I look for crawdads in the river. Don't tell Aunt Marnie, but I fed one to a cow once. Oh gosh. <laughs> Whoops. She loved it. <laughs> <laughs> what the cow, I bet so, huh? Things changed a lot after, uh... Oh, I think we already read that. Okay. Yeah, hey, she, yeah. Jojo Mart's a lot cheaper than Pierre's. That's why, uh, Pam shops at, uh, Jojo Mart. That kind of explains that bit. We already read about that before, so I don't need to read it again, right? But I don't have a scythe or sickle or whatever, so I can't clean out anything over here on the way over to the blacksmith, unfortunately. We oh, yeah, forgot to get the... Uh, I forgot to get this ancient seed and give it to Gunther, and then he'd give us a, an ancient seed we could actually plant. I forgot to do that. Ah, oh, man. Now, nah, whatever. Let's just open up the geode. Uh, bum -bum. Hopefully it's something good. Whoa, what is that? Orpament. What? Is that another thing we have to give? Uh, yeah, you have to give it to Gunther. Okay. I guess if we can spend a little bit of time over there. Oh, wow. There's a rabbit or something like that at the top of the screen. I guess we'll read about that real quick. We have another blackberry down here. We grab there. you go. So let's, let's go donate it. I guess we'll read about it or something. I, I just don't want to spend too much time, you know? Uh, working on everything over here. Like, you know, donating to the museum, reading all that kind of stuff. But I guess we'll read about that orp, orp, orpament or whatever that was. Is that where you return the books? I think it is. It's like that little hole right there. I remember that as a kid. <laughs> Sliding books into there. Let's see. And other things that don't belong in there. <laughs> orpament. Despite its high toxicity, this mineral is widely used in manufacturing uh, and folk medicine. Huh. Never heard of it. Interesting stuff there. Glad we read about it, though, but it's 1.20 p.m. right now. Is there anything else I want to do before I just... To them. Oh, yeah, go, go to Marnie. I guess we'll go over there. I don't know if we'll go to Willy right now. Maybe we'll... Cause I'm like, yeah, we, there's like a whole thing down there, right? But then again, we can go in over the Marnie. I, I, I kind of want to get that done decently. Uh, you know what? Yeah, we're right here at Willy's, basically. Let's let's just go. I wish I had that coffee and we could move a little bit faster. I don't know how you make it. Probably make it like a coffee maker and then... Or you, you could probably buy... Well, I think you buy from some... Uh, that's probably where we actually got ours, I think, right? You buy uh, coffee from the saloon. So, uh, anyways... 
donate more of this. There you go. There's 100 right there. Awesome. Okay, so we have that part of the mission done. We still have the other half of the mission where we actually have to get, like, what is it? What do we have right now? 67. Okay, so we have to get 33 more bug meat. Or we got, like, 27 that last run, so we could probably do it, like, half, like, spending half of the today and then, like, half of tomorrow. And then we could probably get that mission done, right? And I don't think we don't have to like go over there and like donate the stuff because we already did. So I guess. Oh, hey, look at that. There's Willy randomly. What in the world? If the local fishing scene got a little bit more lively, I might expand the shop's stack or shop's stock, I think he said. <laughs> and it was head back over here to Marnie. Go see what she's up to and uh, give her a gold star wheat. Oh, yeah, I forgot about the community. Center. I guess we could just stop by the community center before. Oh, yep, there she is right there. And there's that right there. Incriminating evidence. Uh, supply shop. Purchase it. Oh, yeah. Can I buy more chicken? I guess I could try with... Oh, it's 800 now. Was it se I thought it was 700 beforehand, but maybe the more chickens you get, the more expensive it gets, huh? So I guess we'll do that. There you go. Buy another chicken. So what color is this one? White chicken. Okay, so hopefully we get a... Uh, there you go. Put it there. Gash. <laughs> I don't like the sound of that name. Snurdy. Wine. Lu Lusumo. Poo. <laughs> okay, sure. Poo. P-U. <laughs> okay, I'll send little... Little poo on her... Really, who put these names in the game? <laughs> I'll send little poo on her new on her way to her new home. I can't even read that. Golly. <laughs> That's how ridiculous that is, right? But uh, hopefully this is a brown chicken, right? Because that was a white chicken? I already forgot. Golly. Oh, it is. Hey, look at that. Okay, so Frirt? <laughs> Rena, Snana, Protsley, Jechu, Jorto. F oh, yeah. Wouldn't, uh, there was a meme like with our animals... I mean, like, Zongus right there, and then, like, Zacha and stuff like that. I guess we could find a Z name, Lisa Bell. That's, that seems a little bit too normal. <laughs> Wumbus. <laughs> I like that. You know what? You know what? Yeah, let's do it. Wumbus. What do we have? We have Wumbus, Poo, Memers, and, like, Zacha or something like that. <laughs> I'll send little Wumbus to her new home. Owner. Okay, there you go. Okay, so we have four chickens now, so hopefully we're going to get a lot more money, you guys. That's going to be great. We're going to have to put more uh, food over there, but I think because it's a nice day outside, they should be able to eat all the, the tall girls. Oh, yeah, no. Yeah, because they're going to be babies right now. We're, not, we're probably not going to get eggs from them for a couple days. But still, I think they should still be able to eat the wheat outside, right? Maybe. Might want to might stop by there on the way to the uh, to the mine and put some hay out, like, inside the coop. Just because I don't know if they're able to go outside as babies or chicks or whatever. I'm trying to remember. Either way. Uh, leave. Supply shop. I don't want to buy anything there, but I do have a gift for you. Ba-boom! Thank you, this looks nice. Alright, so, are we able to, uh, nope, not enough. I'll probably have to wait or something like that for the, for the friendship to kind of kick in, I guess. Let's see. Where in the world is she on this? I thought she was one star. Oh, there she is right there. Yeah, she's one, or one heart, whatever. Uh, did she like that? Oh, she's just normal about it. Man, but it was gold star, so hopefully that helped out a little bit. You think someone like her would like wheat? She can just go give it to, like, the cows or whatever, but I guess not. Ah, <sighs> or the chickens. I don't know. She, she probably doesn't even have... I don't even see any chickens over there. Who knows? Anyways, uh, you know, eventually I kind of want... I don't know if you could actually build a bridge across that, but that'd be really cool if you could. But eventually I'd like to build one, just so I don't have to, like, curve around and stuff like that. But... Let's go check them on the chickens. Oh, yeah, and iron is done. Oh, wait, yeah, look at that. The, uh, the chicks are able to just move around. Okay, that's good. Guess we'll grab that egg. Grab that egg. Put them inside this. And then, yeah, you guys did say if I if I do get more chickens, by the way. Get a couple more hay going. You guys did say if I get a couple more chickens, I'll have to get a mu I'll have to get a couple more mayonnaise machines to keep up with that, right? So, I guess we'll have to do that. I do know I still have the gold star, uh like corn in my inventory i guess maybe if we leave the mine early enough like maybe at like 11 30 or something like that we'll be able to donate those to the museum or to the community center on the way back if not maybe we'd wait until tomorrow or something i don't know but i do really want to get the second bug mission done and that strategy seemed like it worked out really really well so i'm just going to try and get a little bit of energy back 25 energy at a time from these blackberries there you go maybe get up like half energy or something like that because i'm like most of the time we're just going to be battling things right and that doesn't require any energy i think and then other times, like, we just have to, like, break the... Oh, yeah, and there, there, there's him right there. I don't know. Maybe I can give him bug meat and eat like that. I don't know. I, I could try it, but it's a little too late. We already rock pa walked past him. Golly. <laughs> but uh, here we go. Let's see if we can find any bugs here. Uh, and then I guess after... Oh, yeah, it's just a diglet guy right there. And then I guess after we're finally done with this heckin' bug mission, we can finally uh, start digging down in the mines and... Actually, you know what? Should I, should I skip this bit? Because I already did it earlier. I don't know. You know what? I might. I might skip this bit, and then maybe, maybe this episode can encompass, like, three different, like, in-game days. That'd be pretty cool. There you go. 
Yeah, you guys, you guys already saw this earlier, so I, I guess I'll skip it. So we have, th I think we have 67 bug meat already claimed. There's earth crystal right there. So that means, oh man, uh, whatever that is right there. Uh, cave carrots, nice. No, it's found actually zero bugs right now, you guys. That is not good. It's 5 p.m. already. So uh, wish me luck, you guys, because I'm not having any luck right now finding any bugs. So let me just pause and I'll see you guys here in just a bit. And uh, hopefully that 30, or, oh wow, look at that. Oh wow, look at that. The game heard me. They spawned in a bunch of maggots and a flying guy over here too. Cool, awesome. But we have a uh, 15 bug meat right now, up to 18. Not bad. Ah oh, man, I'm trying to do the math right now. How much? How much bug meat did we need with the 13 that we already had? I don't know. But uh, hopefully we make some good progress either way, right? So <laughs> let me just pause, go through the mines here until like 11:30 or something like that, and I'll see you guys here in just a bit. All right, guys, are back. As you can see, I'm at 93 out of 100. It's 11:30 right now. I know I said. Oh, I'd, I'd come back whenever it's 11.30, we could leave at 11.30, we can go back to the community center real quick, drop off uh, the, the, the corn or whatever, right? But uh, I'm like, we're so close right now. If we could have a little bit of extra time tomorrow to do whatever else, then hey, I'm all for it, right? There you go. Oh man, there's maggots right there, there's flying bugs, there's a lot of stuff here, awesome, but no bug meat. There you go, there's another one right there, I, th I don't think there's anything else up there, oh wait. Oh, it's a oh, nice, another flying guy right there, okay, okay, okay. And boom, oh, whoops, boom, killed him. Okay, they're coming to me now, awesome. And oh, there you go. Got another bug meat right there, what are we at? What, it's 12.20 right now. Three more, three more, three more, come on! We're so close! I don't want, I don't want to fall down here and, 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 and... Oh man, there's another one over there, but you know what, you know what, you know what? I kind of want to reset, I kind of want to leave. Oh man, how far is this 12.30 right now? Oh my gosh, 12.40. Mmm, you know what, you know what? I guess, I guess we'll leave the mine. It's 12.40 right now. I don't want to lose anything right now, especially... Well then, yeah, it... I don't, I don't think if we lose any bug meat, I, I, don't, I don't think anything will... Oh, wow, another ancient seed. I didn't notice that. But I don't think anything will bad will happen if we uh, if we lose bug meat from dying or whatever, right? But we'll also lose money, of course, right? So if, if I pass out in the mines... Oh, no, if you die in the mines, you get rescued by Willy. And then you lose stuff in the mines. And then you also pass out again. <laughs> and then that's when you lose the money, right? So it's kind of a double whammy sort of meme there. I don't want that to happen. I guess we could spend like five minutes... Or not even that, but maybe like two minutes or something like that tomorrow in game uh to you know finish up the mission especially because it is uh what is it called but what, what am i what am i thinking of right now oh yeah is there anything i want to sell before we probably the mayonnaise but it's a little bit too late for that right red mushroom fiber uh, i guess we'll go to bed real quick there you go. i don't know how long this like episode is and stuff by the way so there you go get that done i do want to i still want to go in the morning try and try and get good relationship point with our all that kind of stuff right trying to get that oh well we all we have the chickens now which is good and by the way, I guess we'll... Oh, wow, a lot of things stacked up right there. Amazing. And then we have another geode right now, too. Right, shoot. I guess we'd have a longer episode today, right? I don't know how long these videos are. I guess I could check. I guess it's not too long, it seems. Okay, so I, I guess we'd have a three-day three, three day episode over here, especially because I did a lot of stuff off-camera. You know, watering all the crops. I'll have to do that again here in just a minute. Water all the crops off-camera, right? But, uh... We did get chickens just a minute ago. I do want to go back to Marnie. Actually, you know what? Let's check that now. Do we have a better relationship point with her now? Hope so. Where is she? Still one star, though. Or one heart. Man, at least we know she likes the wheat. What does she like? I know people probably commented the last episode saying, hey, give her this or that or whatever. But I don't... I don't remember what it was. I don't know where it would be on this. If we have anything good, that is. You know, silver star, gold star. Because that's supposed to help a little bit more, too. Especially on their birthday, but... I'm not, I'm not, I'm not seeing anything, I'm not thinking of anything. I guess we can give her an egg or something like that? I guess we can go check if we have any eggs and not put any inside the mayonnaise machine. Oh yeah, I said I did, I did say I wanted to make a recycling machine too. I said that, and I forgot to do it, I, I said it last episode, forgot the heck and do it, so. <laughs> Let's do it today, uh, put up, okay, there you go. That's good, oh, I forgot to put up the slime and whatever else too, but whatever. Let's get some, there you go, fertilizer, three fertilizer. I do know over here where the, uh, bok choy was pretty, oh, well, that's still fertilized, nice. I know the whatever this was that turned into yams, uh, that kind of opened up some slots right there, so that's good. And we have more stuff there, there, and then fertilizer, fertilizer, and I guess we'll put an extra fertilizer there, sure, why not? And then I'll have to water all the crops over here again, but uh, here we go, corn. I guess she, she could like corn. Like, what's stopping her? Like, she she didn't like, she she was okay with wheat. It's not like she didn't like wheat. It's just, it was just a normal gift. What? Oh, the pumpkins! You guys, I didn't even notice the pumpkins are ready! Ooh, and, and these things over here, what are these? Fairy Rose. I don't even remember that name whenever I bought those. <laughs> but, uh, anything? Oh, yeah, more corn over here. Awesome. Yeah, just have to hover over whatever, and then it'll tell you. Oh, look at the baby chicken. Oh, man, I should probably get the, the farm 
or the, the the fence and stuff to make sure the chickens can't come over here. I don't know if they could trample your crops and stuff, but big old pumpkins. I do know one. Oh, that was four pumpkins, but we got a silver. Three silver star? What? Oh, we got the gold. Awesome. Okay. We didn't get any regulars. We got three silver star and then one gold star pumpkin. I think that's for the community center, right? I think. Yeah, but we need five of them. Hmm. Do we have an... I guess we can go buy more pumpkin seeds while we also buy more bok choy seeds. I think it takes 14 days, though. So if I, if I plant it today on the 14th, we'd have literally the last day of the harvest, it, right? And I guess that'd be it. And then fall crops. Oh, yeah, we have to donate one. Okay, so we'll have the fall crops bundle done. We have to get... We'll donate one of the one of the silver star ones. And I'll have to put up the, uh, the extra. Oh, and by the way, do I have any other seeds I can plant with a... I guess not. Yeah. Oh, man, there's so many things. So many things going on right now. I can't list everything. That's why I keep, like, trampling over my own words and stuff like that. <laughs> Put up uh, all but five of those. And we have these fairy roses here. I guess we'll keep it then. Keep one there. And then gold star pumpkin. I need to keep that as well. What what, what do I have here that doesn't really belong, right? I guess a common silver star mushroom. I guess we'll put that up as well. So there you go. Okay. And I think that's fine. Okay. <laughs> Just trying to clean out my inventory, but uh, I don't think I watered everything today yet, so I still need to do that. But, oh, that's empty. What in the world? What do we put in there? I don't know. But uh, there you go, slime. Oh, yeah, and by the way, I killed a rock crab. Got another crab, which is decent. Was it 100 gold or something like that? So, hey, I'm not going to complain about that. There you go. Get that. Of course, we have the fish around the scythe over there as well. Uh, what do I want to put over here? I guess red mushroom. We could always put that up or just give it to someone. I don't know who would like that, though. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, uh... What is his name? Demetrius. Maybe he would like it because we have that mushroom study going on, right? So maybe he would be okay with that. And then I guess we can sell the Silver Star uh, mushroom right there. Yeah, sure. That's fine. Oh, I, I don't know if I checked the mushrooms yesterday. <laughs> Whoops. But uh, you guys know the drill. Let me... Uh, oh, yeah. By the way, by the way, by the way, before I forget, let's check up on the chickens. Maybe she'll like a Gold Star egg if we have one. Oh, there's the mayonnaise too. Uh, nope. Neither of those. I guess I, I guess I can give her a regular, man, or a regular egg, I guess. I guess I'll put one of them over here, so that would be this one. Then I'll give her the white egg, and then hopefully she's okay with that. Hopefully hopefully, right-clicking her with the egg doesn't throw an egg at her, <laughs> like Minecraft, right? But I'll sell the, uh, there you go, I'll sell the mayonnaise. That's $190 a piece, so $380 right there, getting some great money. We're down, we even spent like $1,600 not too long ago, like yesterday, to get uh, those other chickens. And we're still at $4,000 right now, you guys, whoops. Whoops, there you go. But yeah, we have we have so much money right now. We definitely want to spend it and spend it wisely, of course, right? Don't want to don't want to splurge on anything that we don't need, right? But I uh, definitely want to go get more pumpkin seeds, I guess. I don't know how many I'm comfortable buying. Oh, that was way too much right there. See, this is what I'm talking about. I'm not paying full attention over here. But uh, I don't know how much I'd be comfortable buying with the pumpkins. I guess it just kind of depends on how much money I have. And I have way more money right now than I had beforehand, right? So... Uh, either way, before I get too distracted and miss more stuff, like I said, <laughs> let me pause real quick, keep watering everything over here, make sure I got every plot watered, and I'll see you guys here in just a bit, and we'll probably go buy a bunch of seeds from uh, Pierre. And yes, it is Sunday, so we should be open. Who isn't open on Sunday? I can't, I don't think, no, yeah, I didn't write down anyone on Sunday in my notes, so I guess everyone should be open today. Except for people that I don't know about, and I, then I can update my notes again. But either way, you guys know the drill. Let me keep watering over there. Watering everything over here before I can forget and miss something. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Alright guys, I'm back. Looks like I did miss out on a corn, so uh, I'm glad that I did that or else I would have forgotten. Missed out on that corn again, I bet, right? But let's put the gold, or uh, the red, red mushroom up there. There you go, put the right thing there. And I guess we'll put up the extra corn. Oh yeah, and by the way, I missed an eggplant too, so yeah. <laughs> that's another thing that I missed out on, so that's good that I got that there. And then yeah, we got a bunch of corn. Then a cave carrot. That's basically just get stamina. I'll probably eat that here in just a bit. But uh, it's 12, almost 12 right now, I guess. Yeah, I, I guess we can go over, open up the geode at the blacksmith. By the way, all the chickens are... Oh, wow, this is done already. What in the world? <laughs> oh, yeah, let's go pet our uh, chickens over here, too. I forgot to pet them. I think we could pet... The, there you go, pet the baby, too. There you go, pet, pet the brown one. There's another brown one, I think, over here. Or I'm like, you can't tell. They're always yellow whenever they're baby chicks, right? Oh, there it is. Oh, wait, no, never mind. That one's uh, brown as a little baby chick. Okay, cool. Cute. <laughs> but uh, let's go put up the, uh, the watering can over here. There you go. Now, what did I say I wanted to give Marnie? An egg. Yes. Okay. And then also put that up in the community center. Just trying to remember everything over here before I, before I heck and uh, forget. And then, yeah, I did want to head to the mines real quick to go uh, get three bugs, I think, right? What are we at? 97? Yeah. So that's so doable. I don't want to leave without that, you know, basically getting done, right? So, anyways, right now, let's just go down to Marnie. Uh, 12. Yeah, she should be open, right? Go give her the, uh, the egg. Hopefully, uh, give her, you know, get good friendship points with her. I don't know if we're going to get those points immediately or what whatever. And if we'll be able to actually go into that room, grab the pants, 
because I think that event is supposed to happen on like Tuesday or something like that. So that's why I'm trying to get her. Oh yeah, you can't do it. Yeah, because we already gave her gifts, two gifts this week, didn't we? Did we? I feel like I gave her something. Oh wait, no, yeah, it reset on Sunday, didn't it? So everything, everything's reset. Okay, so let's go in there and let's go give her another thing. Okay, let's see. I don't want to buy any more chickens. I don't have any more room, but I do have a present. Thank you. Okay, now can we go into here? I still can't go into there, man. What did she think about the egg, though? I hope she was okay with it. Marnie. Okay, she liked it. That's good. That's good that she liked it. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe next to... Oh, and there's Shane up there. I, I guess we can go talk to him. Just go say, hey, how's it going? I don't have any peppers on me, unfortunately. Oh, yeah, I can go inside of his room. Yep. Hey, how's it going? Hmm, it's 1 p.m. Should I throw a frozen pizza in the microwave or should I wait? Yeah, don't throw a frozen pizza in the microwave. What are you doing? What are you, a caveman? Put it in the heckin' oven. It'll, it'll have a crunchier crust. It won't be all soggy and nasty, too. I guess we'll go to the blacksmith, too. Go open up the geode. Um, oh, I forgot the ancient seeds again. Do I want to go back home real quick? Yeah, let's go home real quick and let's go grab... <laughs> Man, I'm over here, like, trying to... Do like so many things. I keep forgetting things here and there too. And I guess I guess we could take that other route, the northern route, like or actually east of our farm. Go to the community center real quick. Go give it the pumpkin. Go give it the five gold star corn. And then yeah, the museum I think is open till like six or something like that, right? So they're they're open decently late. They should be fine. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm just trying to think in my head all this kind of stuff, right? Let's go grab a singular. Actually, you know what? If I give them one, yeah, because whenever you give them an artifact, like. The rest of them don't become artifacts anymore. I thought I'd take both of them just to see what happens. So there you go. It's 2 p.m. right now. Actually, you know what? Let's go to the museum right now. And then on the way to the mines, we'll give the uh, well, the community center and stuff. Man, I forgot. Yeah, there are hazelnuts and plums over here. I forgot about yesterday. Man. And hey, look at that. The, uh, the trees are back, just like you guys said. Yeah, so these are the trees you guys said I should put the taps on. Just because we t we pass by these all the time. And because they regenerate, like, really fast. Or maybe, maybe it was the other way, other way around. Maybe because it was regenerate really fast, that's why I should cut them down. I think so. I think that's what you guys were saying. I do want to go check up on this at all. Oh yeah, it's been a while since there was a mission over here. Let's go see. What is that? Clint could, uh, would like to hire someone to fetch a carp. Yeah, I'm like, I'm not going to be fishing anytime soon. Because with all the heckin' stuff we're doing right now with them. Oh, it was Abigail's birthday yesterday! And I had amethyst and everything too! I was so preoccupied with that. and the bug meats and stuff. Man! Oh, that sucks. Ah, oh, man. I don't know what the luck is today. I'm not even going to go through the trash. I feel so bad now because she's one of our, like, better friends and everything, too. So, feel, it feels so bad that we've got her birthday. Uh, that's, probably, that's probably why she, we should buy one of those calendars that we could keep at home so we just kind of look at the calendar whenever. I'm like, she was up there. Ah, oh, she has two hearts right now. Yeah, she, she loves the amethyst. There's the sweet peas. That's from spring. Uh, I, I guess seeing her a little bit lower down on the friends list. I don't feel as bad, but st I still feel bad, though. Oh, whoops. Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I wanted to go over here for the ancient seed, so, uh, give him one ancient seed. Okay, yeah, okay, grabbed one. Okay, let, let's put the other one right, uh, right there. There you go. New, hey, new, not, re not new record, new reward. Reward. Oh, yep, 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 there's, okay, so you guys did say, if you give him an ancient seed, or that artifact ancient seed, he'll give you an actual ancient seed you could plant, but I think you guys said don't plant this until next like spring or some of that because it takes 28 days, right? An ancient seeds recipe. Ooh, so I can make even more ancient seeds out of that. What? So hold on. How would I do? Do I just need regular ancient seeds that you get from the, the cave or do I have to combine them together with something? Let's see. Let's seed. Oh yeah, it is. Okay, so you just convert the ancient seeds you get from the cave to ancient seeds you can actually plant and then boom, there you go. Okay, so we have two of those. I guess I, guess I could do that right now, right? And we'll have two of them stacked on top of each other. Boom. All right, cool. Uh, let's go read about the one that's over here, though. There it is. Whoops. There it is right there. I don't know how it's casting such a huge shadow when it's so small, <laughs> but there we go. Uh, ancient seed. It's a dry old seed from some ancient plant. By all appearances, it's long since dead. Well, uh, that one is, but uh, you, all you have to do is just put it in your inventory, then convert it to an actual plantable seed, and then boom, you're good to go. <laughs> it's as easy as that, right? But remember, we do have another geode, so let's go over here to black to the blacksmith, Clint. Like, right before he closes, I think he closed at 4. It's 3.40 right now, so... Yep, there you go. Uh, process tools. Yeah, we're, we're starting to get a pretty good amount of iron. We definitely do want to upgrade our tools. I just don't know what i upgrade first. Probably my pickaxe, right? Uh, there you go. Geode, what are we going to get? Oh, whoa! What is that? Thunder egg! Whoa! That sounds special. And, of course, it's another thing to give a Gunther. I don't think that was one of the things you guys said to not give to him and just keep if I, if, if I come across it. I think that was, like, some other thing. Like, some prism thing or something. 
I'll, I'll keep it for now, though. Hey, there's Leah. Let's just casually just talk to her. There's a lot of good places to walk around here. I'm like, yeah, it's outside. What do you expect? <laughs> it feels good to stretch your legs. Okay, there you go. And there's Penny all the way over there as well. I guess it could. Uh, you know what? You know what? You know what? Blackberry. Everyone loves them except for Haley, of course. Right, go Lee. This is a really nice gift. Hey, babe. At least people are starting to appreciate me, right? What about you, Pam? Do you appreciate blackberries? You did a good, or you did good with this one, kid. Thanks. Yeah, look at that. Maybe she'll turn that uh, into blackberry beer or something. I don't know. <laughs> or blackberry wine. I don't know. But let's go up here. Let's go to the community center real quick on the way to the mines to finish up the heckin' mission before it actually... Oh, yeah. And then uh, whatever your name is. <laughs> Caroline. I always forget. Oh, that's sweet. Thank you. It is. I'm like, it is blackberry. So, of course, it's going to be sweet, right? There you go. Actually, I don't know. Aren't blackberries, like, somewhat bitter? But I don't know. I'm, I'm not a berry expert. Let's go over here, though. Finish up the... That's foraging down there, I think. Okay, let's go over here. Then we should be able to do quality, yeah, quality crops. Five gold corn. There's blackberry there, and then there's pumpkin. Okay, I need to do the fall crops, and then boom. Bundle complete. All right. We're getting pretty close, pretty close to that greenhouse, which you guys said I definitely want to have for wintertime, so we can actually plant stuff during the winter, but unfortunately... Oh, well, I guess if anything, I could have donated one of the eggs. Well, no, yeah. See, I need a large egg there, which I don't know how you get that. And large milk, and then lar or large goat milk, yeah, and then wool, and then duck. Yeah, so there's a lot there. There's no way you could finish this in your first year unless you're a heckin' pro. Cherries and stuff. Oh, yeah, jelly. I forgot to donate the jelly. Man. Cloth apple. Yeah, you know what? Whenever it comes springtime, that's when we want to buy those trees. Just kind of get those done right. Oh, way a bee house. Place outside and wait for delicious honey. Hey! You know what? We, we've, we've been able to make a bee house for the longest time, but I never did. Where is that? Yeah, there it is right there. Oh, yeah, well, I needed maple syrup. That's the reason why I never made it, because i that's what the tree taps are for, right? Oh, what in the world? This guy's in the way. <laughs> Move! Hurry up! Hark, hark! Get out of the way! Okay, well, I don't know how I just stepped over him right there, but I did. <laughs> okay, that's good. Uh, my inventory's somewhat full right now. I guess I'll eat those, uh, ugh, I'll eat the white algae right there. Ugh, disgusting. This came out of the maggots and everything, too. <laughs> I saw someone commenting that it was so disgusting. I'm eating the white algae. It came out of maggots, but still. At least it's getting me some of my energy back, which I do need for the mines, right? So there you go. And then uh, I definitely want to keep those ancient seeds, which, by the way, they don't even stack up on top of each other. They're like separate things on the hotbar, which kind of sucks. But uh, Scott, you, my husband, almost set the house on fire last night with his science experiment. One of the beakers, or one of his beakers, exploded and sent a fireball into the rafters. Thank Yoba, I used fire resistant lacquer when I built the place. Okay, it sounds like a little bit of an advertisement right there. <laughs> Let's go to the mines real quick. Literally real quick. All we have to do is just kill three bugs and we're good to go, right? And hey, Demetrius, I think he liked the uh, blackberry, right? Yeah, very interesting specimen. He says that every time. We already know it's like a good positive response from him, so don't need to check up on that. Let's go down to layer 15. Kill literally. Oh, wow. Look at that maggots right there. Awesome. And two. Wow. It's like the game knows I'm super duper close. I think that's two of them, right? I think we just need one. Nah, we, okay, we only got one right there. Still, still missing two bug meat. Way down. There's another bug meat right there. Oh, we got it! We got it! 3,000 gold! We got it! I don't even have to talk to whoever. What was this, Willie? I think it was Willie that wanted this mission, right? What if I go talk to him right now? What happens? Uh, oh, never mind. That's, we already read that before. But hey, look at that. We got 3,000 gold! Awesome! Okay. Well, it's Sunday right now, so if we go back to... Oh, wow, look at this. Boom, boom. Look at all these bugs. It's like they're spawning them in on purpose right now, you guys. This is awesome. There you go. Yeah, you know what? You know what? I guess we'll leave the mine at six something. Oh, well, we can go down right there. But six something right now. Uh, I guess we can leave the mine, go to the chest right here, empty some of the stuff into the chest, such as rice shoot. Don't care about it. So there you go. <laughs> then uh, bug meat. I guess we'll put that up right now. And then wild plum hazelnut. I could eat those. So uh, then, you know what? Bee house. You know what? These things here. Bee house ancient seeds. I'll put those there. Oh, it's, it does stack up. Okay, that's good. Uh, then gold star blackberry. You know what? I'll put those up as well. And then thunder. I'll put those up. But these things right here, I'll eat, and then, uh, you know, we can grab those on the way back. But I kind of want to go to layer, layer 50, maybe start making a little bit of progress here, just because it's been a little while. And because we've already been doing a lot of mining stuff anyway, so might as well just continue it, right? There you go. What in the world's that thing? There's a heckin' ghost! There you go, hitting ghost with a bug head. There you go. Go down, go down. There you go. Yeah, this looks, seems like the frozen rocks or whatever right here take two hits to actually break. They're a little bit more durable, so I'm not used to them, right? There you go. Bats and heckin' literal ghosts. I don't, I, I don't think that ghost has anything to do with it being fall, right? Maybe it does. Maybe it's just been that long since I've been in the, the depths of the mines that I completely forgot. Who knows? But uh, there you go. We're just starting to take some heckin' damage from that guy. Whoa! We got the solar essence! Oh, wait, no. I, yeah, I, I've been down here and, and seen ghosts before. Yeah, I remember getting that solar essence before. I think we gave one to the community center, right? I think so. There you go. Golly, face the right direction. 
<laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, oh man, another way down right there. Awesome. Okay, I kind of want to get a cave carrot going. Heal up a little bit, get a little bit of energy back. And there you go. 13 health. Yeah, not bad, but also not good. <laughs> Let's kill these little fuzzy guys to give us a little bit of coal. Remember, we're actually out of coal back home. Oh, well, yeah, we have a few more. I'm not necessarily out, but we're, we're I'd, I'd say we're low on coal, so it certainly wouldn't hurt to kill these guys and get more coal, right? Wow, there's a lot of them up there. Oh my gosh, there's so many. Oh man, I killed a bunch right there. Awesome. Oh man, there's more angry slime right there. Look at him. He's got like red rosy cheeks because he's so angry. <laughs> or is that, I don't know if those are his eyes that are red right there or his cheeks. <laughs> I can't tell. Maybe he's just super duper cute looking for me now. I don't know. And there you go. Trying to, trying to prevent me from killing him. That's why he's looking so cute. <laughs> And let's just go down these stairs right here. There you go. Yeah, ignore the ignore the bat. Oh wow, another pathway right there. Or at least it looks like that. But there's another pathway down right there. Coal iron. I think it's a bat right there. Yeah. And I guess we'll kill the bat. And then we'll eat another cave carrot. And then uh, maybe some blackberries or something here in just a sec. More iron right there too. Cool. That's good. That's good. Literally cool because we're in the the cool caves here. There you go. There you go. Getting killed. And let's kill these guys. Or at least start doing damage to them. Get the cave carrot. Get a little bit of inventory back, as well as a little bit of health and energy. Not necessarily a bad thing. There you go. Got a little, little coal bouncy guys here. Fuzzy coal guys. <laughs> you know, kill them. See if there's anything else over here. Oh, man, I might, I might just keep going down, honestly. Oh, man, another bat. I might just go, 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 go. Go down. There might be something over there. I don't know. But I kind of would just go down and discover it. It's, nah, it's 930 right now. Well, let's just get as deep as we can. It's going to be from layer 53. Yep, here we go. Awesome. Oh, wait. Yeah, we've been here before. Yeah. Yeah, look at that. Okay, well, there's just iron and stuff there. If there's other stuff, then, yeah, I guess we'll just go. There we go, level 54? I think this is, yeah, I remember this now. Yeah, I think I think we either passed out or died or something here, or a little bit of both. <laughs> maybe we passed out, and then, or maybe we died, and then we passed out. Because if you die too late, you'll eventually uh, pass out, right? You'll, you'll get rescued by lions, and then uh, you'll have to pay a fee anyways. So <laughs> it's kind of a double whammy. I think I mentioned it earlier in the video, right? But, uh, let's kill these guys, I guess. Here we go. Get a bunch more coal. Awesome. Break these crystals. I don't know if breaking the crystals is necessarily, like, something you should do, but I feel like you're supposed to do that. I forget if we ever got anything out of those, but I guess we'll break it. If anything, you just swipe your sword and then boom. So I guess it's not too bad to try and, uh, try and use that strategy. Oh man, another, uh, wait, oh, is that fire quartz there? Is that just regular quartz? Oh, okay, it's just regular quartz. Yeah, remember, we're still missing, like, the fire quartz or whatever. So that kind of sucks that we're missing that, uh, for the community center, I believe, right? That's, like, literally one of the only things that we're missing for one of the bundles so kind of sucks we're so heckin' close but yet so far away there you go break those and i don't think i don't think we found the way down it's 11 p.m right now i kind of want to start finding the way down let's do it let's just forget forget about the slime guy right there he's not that big of a deal he's not that big of a threat oh there you go and layer 55 another uh, another elevator right there unlocked awesome that's what i wanted so i guess we can spend a little bit of time here until like midnight then we'll be good to go kill this guy i'm gonna get some stuff from him i don't know there i kill the bat get bat wings Kill this frozen slime, ice slime, whatever he is, I don't know. There you go. And then whatever, oh wow, getting lubricant, or uh, sap. Looks like lubricant from, uh, what do you call it, Subnautica though. <laughs> little, little yellow droplet, that's why. Uh, whoops, whoops, I should not be using the pickaxe on that, whoops. Man, I don't know if there's anything else around here. This kind of reminiscent of uh, an earlier level. Like, I feel like I've seen this, like this was like low, layer 15 or something like that, right? I don't know. I don't want to break this though, see if we get anything out of this gigantic rock that I'm breaking. Nope, just a bunch of stone. <laughs> okay, whatever. Uh, it's midnight right- Oh, wow, the way down. Is there anything here, though? That's going to be at least a shortcut out of here, if so. Oh, man, a bunch of iron, a bunch of- few ghosts right there, though. Whoops. Okay, let's leave them behind. It's 12.20 right now. We'll have to grab a few of our things from the chest. Uh, there we go. Stone. There you go. And then, uh, I guess rice. Right, sure, I, at least I can fit everything back in my inventory, so that's good. So that's, that's where that chest comes into play right there. So that's really cool, you guys. Awesome. Made some great progress today, you guys. I feel so good. To have that bug meat mission done, I guess next episode when we when we start a uh, another heckin' week long mission, we'll probably have another repeat and we'll spend like a whole entire week, like three or four episodes, working on whatever that mission would be, right? But I guess we'll have to wait until then to find out what that is. Uh, we have a solar essence right there. I don't know what to do with that. It says monster loot, and I feel like we already gave it to them, either museum or the community center. So I guess I'll keep it. Maybe I'll try and sell it. I don't know. I guess we'll see. Oh yeah, mushrooms over here. I don't think I checked up on the mushrooms, did I? Uh, no, I did not. Okay. Let's see, is there anything in my inventory I don't care about getting rid of? Yeah, we have tons of stone. I guess I'll get rid of that. And oh yeah, you know, I did get comments of you guys saying I could just drop the stuff. Like dropping the stone like this. So uh, there you go, just like in Minecraft. Oh wait, no, never mind, it magnetizes back into your inventory. <laughs> okay, there you go, get rid of that. There you go. Get the, get these right here. I don't care too much about the common mushroom, red mushroom, that'd be nice to have. Uh, maybe if I face this away, drop the slime, there you go. I can get the, oh, 
Yeah, okay, there it is right there. Okay. Okay, let's go home now. 120. I guess I can grab the mayonnaise, but it might be a little bit too late for that. Whatever. Not that big of a deal. And all those things are still watered down there. Okay, that's good. That's good. Let's go inside. 130. <laughs> Jeez. And let's see. Go to sleep for the night. Hopefully we get a level up for like fighting or something like that. Oh, we got a level up for farming. Oh, I forgot to buy the seeds for the pumpkins and stuff. Oh, is it too late now? Because it'd be the 15th. Oh, I think. It, oh, well, I guess if anything, we could use the speed grow fertilizer to help it speed up by 10%, which if it takes 14 days to grow, that would that would knock off a day right there, right? I guess we could do that. That could be an emergency sort of thing we do. But we have the loom now and the quality retaining soil and plus one watering can proficiency and hope proficiency. Okay. I think that means it uses less water and energy and stuff like that, right? I think. I'm not 100% sure. But we got $720 overnight on top of the 3000 we got for finishing that week-long special request mission. So getting some great money, guys. That's awesome. And we're going to be getting even more money from all the heckin'. Oh, yeah. And then we have the bee house. <laughs> Probably going to get some money out of that, too. At least until winter starts, right? But remember, we're going to get a lot more money out of the heckin' chickens that we have. The other, uh, the other chickens that we got. And, uh, should be adults now, right? Or does it take three days for that? I forget. Oh, wait, no, yeah, see, they're not adults yet. Whoops. Let's see, let's check up on you. Yeah, I still want half a heart right there. And one month, I don't know. I don't know how long it takes for that, though. But, uh, then we have eggs and stuff over here, I guess. Do I want to give Marty another heckin' egg? Because at least we know she likes it. Oh, is she two hearts now? She is... Oh, she's still one, man. Tomorrow's Tuesday and we can't uh, I might have to like cheat and look at the comments and see who what what she likes because I know someone probably told me and I guess we could use that. To, oh wow look at the foraging items down there all done nice. Dear Waffle I just wanted to remind you that Stardew Valley or the Stardew Valley Fair is happening tomorrow. Don't forget to bring your nine items for the grand display. Remember the fair starts at 9 a.m. in the town square. See you there. Be there or be square right. <laughs> Anyways, I guess we'll end off the episode right here. I don't know if it was a longer episode or what, but uh, it covered up three in-game days, which we haven't done in quite a while. So hopefully it was enough for you guys, especially with all the repetitive cave bug meat stuff that we did earlier on, right? But either way, I guess I'll end it off right now. And then uh, next time we come back, we could actually do something with that uh, bee house that we have. Uh, we can give Marnie hopefully something that she really loves to get that two hearts thing from her and go into her bedroom, get the heckin' pants and see what happens when we use that as the display item for the, the fair tomorrow. And then uh, also remember, because it is tomorrow that the fair happens, I guess we can go through our chest up here, our gold star chest, see what is like gold star and like a good variety of gold star uh, things that we could put on display, like gold star corn, gold star sweet peas, hops, hot pepper, you know, other stuff like that, you know, because it did say not only the quality of your items comes into play there, but also the, uh, like the diversity of your items and uh yeah of course we have a lot of forging items down here too and i want to write i'm going to write this in my notes right now buy heckin buy more pumpkin and i already have a bok choice yeah i have bok choice seeds in here already but i'll put it in there anyways choice seeds then we can plant both of those and then uh, i guess we could use the speed grow fertilizer i think we have those if not maybe we can make more of them yeah see we have 15 of those uh increases growth rate by at least 10 percent makes it into tilled soil yeah Okay, so if I if I can afford it, I'm going to get heckin' 15 pumpkins. I don't care. <laughs> and then hopefully we'll have uh, that many more, uh, that much more likelihood of us getting... Oh, if anything, yeah. Because it's going to be speed grow. We're not going to be able to use the fertilizer on it. And the fertilizer is what gets you the, the higher likelihood of getting the, the, the higher quality, like the stars and stuff. Ooh. Nah, I don't know. Maybe, maybe if we throw... If we get, like, 15 of them, maybe one or two of them will be gold still, right? Because if we have 15 of them, like, the, what are the heckin' odds that one or two of them will still be gold, right? So... That's kind of my thinking there. Then once spring comes around, we'll have, just have to get the five parsnips, which I think we already sold those, so we'll have to start from scratch from that. But then we'll be basically done with the quality crops bundle, and all we have to worry about then is, like, getting apples and stuff for the artisan bundle and stuff for the animal bundle, which we'll probably have a lot more money uh, by then. We'll actually have, like, cows and maybe sheep and chickens and... Or, you know, whatever gives us the big eggs, large eggs or some of that. Maybe the elder chickens or something. I don't know. I guess we'll have to find out. But until then... I guess we'll end off the episode right here. So thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as the next episode of Stardew Valley comes out so you don't miss it because it is going to be the fair episode. So that's going to be pretty interesting to see what happens if we're actually able to use uh, Mayor Lewis's pants as a display item. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Stardew Valley. Oh, bye there. Oh.